for coming to us next is our sister Coco again. Oh, let's give it up for Coco. Coco herself is a, let's give it up for her. Thank you, thank you. She's an author. She writes children's books, but right now she's coming to read a letter from our governor. So let's give it up and give our ears and our attention to what our governor has to say, all right? Wonderful. All right? Woo! Okay, thank you. Thank you, Rini Love. Thank you. All right. Um, yes, we have a wonderful letter here from, Jay, uh, from Jim Hines. I, he, actually, he has James here, but we all know him as Jim, right? You know him as Jim Hines? He is the member of Congress, so here's a great letter that we're going to share with you from him, from his office. It says, welcome back, students. In the year that lies ahead, each and every one of you will be exposed to new opportunities and have a chance to prosper, yet at the same time, life will throw some curveballs. We all know that life will throw some curveballs at us, but there will be challenges um, that will be present, yet ultimately, with hard work and determination, we can overcome even the gravest of problems. When I grew up, I made sure I took advantage of every chance I had to do well, both inside and outside of school, and I hope you all do the same. The need for effort is something that does not go away after each school day, but hard work and commitment is a prerequisite for success throughout our lifetime. Setting goals. Didn't we hear that earlier? Setting goals is yet another requirement for those who hope to achieve great things in life. So I ask, as the president did, that each of you establishes a goal for the upcoming year. It may have to do with reading more books, spending more time and effort on homework, getting higher grades, or studying more for tests. Yet more importantly, whatever this goal may be, it is crucial that you commit to it. With perseverance, these goals can be achieved, yet not only the goals you set for this year, but for all those you make in the future. As we embark on the school year, remember that what you learn every day will help shape the rest of your life. Never forget your responsibilities and hard work and perseverance. If we, if we both live up to our responsibilities, we can ensure that our generation and their achievements are amongst the greatest and the most significant contributions in history. That is from James Himes, the member of Congress. So good luck and best to all of you. Education, education, education.